In a nutshell, the ISMB program can be summarized into two parts. Firstly, sport, and then secondly, also managerial. So in that sense, um, what the ISMB program is, is a combination of um, sports as well as management. ISMB um, is an international sport management study with a strong focus on hands-on experience. I chose for ISMB because I really wanted to combine sports as well as management. For me, those are two of my biggest passions and uh, if there was any program out there, this was it. Well, I choose ISMB because I come from a sporty background and I, sp I played sports at a high level. The thing is that I didn't want to uh, stop the sport world. I really wanted to, to yeah, be a manager in that or do something with the economics in that. So um, then looking at ISMB, you also have the Dutch, the Dutch form of it, of course. But the international aspect in it, that's just, that's really unique and it's, it felt like a great opportunity for me. When I was searching for a study, I definitely wanted to study in English and um, I wanted to have a study which, an, which has an international focus and an international uh, perspective. I chose ISMB because I'm passionate about sport, first of all, and uh, definitely about, uh, because of the international aspect. ISMB program has uh, a lot of opportunities in it. It's very broad when you begin, so you have a lot of sports that, that you'll get into and also many opportunities from, from management, business or sports. Um, then in the last part of ISMB you'll get more of a direction that you need to pick. So then you can choose from the three, um, the, main, the main focuses, which will be high performance, sport development and sport commerce. So uh, you pick one, but even though it's, it's one focus, you still have many opportunities within those. In every subject there is an international, um, uh, international focus. For example, in sports and society, we look at sports uh, from different cultures. For example, we take uh, the Asian culture into account and how, this is, uh, how the Asian culture is influencing the Asian sport culture. ISMB is truly, truly international and it's not just the, the teacher and the student population that's international but it's also the literature that we choose which comes from lots of different countries, the cases that we apply, uh, the companies and organisations that we talk about come from different parts of the globe. English is uh, mandatory, you, hear, you can hear uh, English throughout the day and uh, even afterwards when you have to uh, to read papers and um, yeah, the chosen literature is also of course in English and um, we have literature from, uh, from the US, we have literature from Australia so we get an international uh, perspective from different points of view. You're in a class with uh, international people, with that you get to learn about different cultures and work together and you see how, how hard it is to work with different cultures and before that I had no clue, I thought everyone would be the same. In, in regard to the international part of the ISMB program, you're looking at firstly the students. The students come from all over the globe. When I consider my class, we have uh, a lot of nationalities represented in our class. For example, I'm uh, from Germany, then we have students from Curaçao, we have, from, uh, we have students from Alaska, so um, it's uh, the whole world. The whole world is represented in ISMB. Actually, you're going to experience firstly a lot of international students, a lot of international lecturers, for example, from the UK, um, from the States, you name it. And then also, of course, the sports that we play. They're also extremely international. They can range from being just domestic sports from here in Holland to also as far as um, let's say native sports from Canada and the US. Well, the uniqueness of ISMB, of course, is the combination of the practical sports with theory. And, of course, theory on a deep level of management. And the international aspect of, of ISMB, of course, is, uh, is it, well, it has to do with all kinds of students coming uh, from all over the world. The subjects, uh, for example, uh, cross-cultural uh, uh, management, and, of course, uh, the internships. You can go for three internships worldwide. So it's up to you how international you can make it. And the assignments that we set the students for each subject, whether that's a practical subject or whether it's a theoretical subject, we try and make sure that the students really get out of uh, their comfort zone and step into uh, the shoes of another nationality or another culture or another type of target group that they're not used to. A friend of mine, he was, who was in the third years, he actually 
convinced me about this study. And after the day that I had the selection day, I was totally confirmed that I really wanted to go to ISMB. So at, after the selection day, I was hoping that I would get in because otherwise I wouldn't have had anything different because I wanted this so badly.